ensuring quality at the production line. Kathy Ko is supervising the production of ceramic water filters. The project is inspired by an outbreak of water-related illnesses in Uganda when she visited the country as a volunteer. While living with the host family, I realized that I was getting sick all the time, my host family was getting sick all the time, and we didn't have a reliable source of accessing clean drinking water. Um, the products on the market were really expensive, or you know, most people were relying on boiling water. And so I thought, you know, there has to be a better way to do this. Uh, there has to be a cheaper, more effective way to get access to clean drinking water. Thanks to various grants and funding, she's set up this facility in Nakauka, a few kilometers outside Kampala. Studies from a local non-government organization, water.org, show 21% of Ugandans don't have access to clean water. This filter is designed to provide safe drinking water to a family of 10 people for two years. Kathy Ku, the founder of this project, believes the filters will go a long way to save many lives of Ugandans who die from waterborne diseases. Hadija Nakivule has been using the filter for two years and can already see its benefits. Before I got the filter, my family was constantly falling ill, but now we are healthy. Health care authorities are encouraging local communities to purchase the filters. They cost about $20 each. To make them more affordable, KU has partnered with other non-profit organizations, hoping that eventually all Ugandans will have access to clean and safe drinking water. Hilara Isiga, CGTN, Wakiso, Central Uganda.